So the creative process for our song Magic actually started back in California. Mason had this looping station and he was playing the coolest, like, melodic, I don't even, I can't even explain, it just touched me, like it just felt like something special. Secret signs etched on my armor Pretty nightmares in my bed Like some necromantic charmer Whispers to the dead You're all up in my head I, I saved it uh, in my loop station and I showed uh, a lot of people just that when you when you turn it on it's you know you can you can change to a loop that you have saved and I'd play it for people and then play kind of like some lead guitar stuff over it just riffing on some melodies and stuff like that and people generally were always like there's something special about this we don't know what it is but this feels really cool and I think this is gonna be something So we put it into our pockets and kind of kept it for something that was going to be special and obviously writing with Chuck Cannon and Laurie White is always very special. Yeah, we kind of took the seed that we had kind of planted within the looping station and everything that Mason was doing and they just helped us make it into this huge song that that is also very stripped down, but it's it's got this massive thing and melodies that kind of evoke feelings that you don't really understand why you're even feeling them and then paired with kind of a, a darker lyric, but it's about, you know, the power of being in love and wanting that person to stay and like just not being able to get enough of, of that person and the kind of spell that they have on you, so to speak. To have such a a strong affinity for a start and to, to sit down with Chuck and Laurie and have it finish so strong. So we were really happy with the way that it turned out in, in every way. Oh, won't you work a 